What it means to me and my family is just, I don't know if words can describe it because you grow up so young. I was probably 14 and a half when I first arrived in Columbus and now 20 years old back sitting in a locker room full of champions really and I think words really can't describe it. I mean my family and me, it's like an emotional moment for me. It's still settling in and like I put my head on the pillow and I'm like wow like it really is and I'm excited and I'm ready for it and I can't wait to learn from the guys here and from the staff and I think everybody is from the fans to the front office you can see that Columbus wants to be the best and we are the best right now and we want to keep improving and to keep improving on a culture that is already established and it's going to be good to just learn from a lot of the guys and I'm only going to be able to control what I can control and that is just working hard and paying attention to the details and trying to be ready for when my time is ready to go. So I think Columbus is home to me and Cleveland is home to me and I think the amount of hours and sacrifice that I put in to drive was probably four hours total every night, four times a week just to train and the sacrifice that my parents went through and I think it just means so much that you can play for the team that like I've only ever played for so like I don't like I, I want to be here like this is my home and it just I don't really know how to describe home like it just feels like in my heart that it's the place that I want to be at so I remember those cold rainy nights after practice just getting in the car and you're sitting there and you're freezing like it's just freezing cold and you get home at 9 30 10 o'clock and you're getting up at 7 30 to go to school and then you're getting in the car again at 2 30 driving two and a half hours to get to practice at four or five o'clock and then you're back in the car and I think what was really special is that as my time progressed throughout the academy you could see the effort of Columbus trying to make it possible for, to bring the Cleveland kids and to get other kids from not only the Columbus area but to Columbus so you could reach and they could pull kids from all over and what I would just tell kids is if you have a dream and a passion for something that you really want to achieve is just go for it like don't let anybody tell you you can't do it or don't let anybody tell you you have to do it this way or that way just put your mind to it and it might like be very difficult like I mentioned there was many times like I was like wow like I, I don't know if I'm gonna make it like I can't do it and then I just do it and then in the long run like the sacrifices each and every day that you put in it like it's paying off and it's still like, I want to achieve a lot more but I think if you keep taking the individual habits and the individual qualities every day and it can turn out to something special at the end and in the long run so I have a great relationship with all of them Aiden Abuba, Sebastian, I think we grew up playing two and a half, three seasons together, all of us, and traveling together, hotels, playing on the field, wins, losses, bus rides, I think they've been just great in helping me just keep improving and just keep my mind and you just keep sharp and knowing that if you keep putting in the work that your chance to become a professional is always on the table if you're working hard, so I think they're all great guys, they're all great personalities. I know them very well and I think we're just gonna gel really good. And I think it just shows that, again, back to what Columbus has been putting in throughout the academy and shows their efforts to making a dominant academy in the United States and worldwide. So I think it's just great and I'm excited and looking forward to seeing all their smiles in the preseason. And I followed them a lot this season and throughout the years and I think I, I really look up to Darlington Nagby and the midfielders Arthur and I just know that I can learn so much from the other midfielders even Sebastian and Aiden like I'm a midfielder I think I can learn from each and every single one of them like they're the, they're the defending champs and they are champions and I think they bring experiences and lessons and values and skills and techniques that I can learn definitely and I think it's going to be just great learning from each and every one of them as they're all different players and they're all different human beings like I mentioned before so I'm excited to learn from each and every one of them. As far as as a player, I think I want to be known and I want Columbus to know me and I think they already do and I want the fans to know me as just a hardworking, tempo, rhythm, likes to get on the ball, movements, vision, passing, left and right feet, can take some set pieces if need be and just ready to put in the work and just keep the ball and keep the tempo flowing for the team.